Hey guys, welcome back to my IGTV and this is going to be our episode number 29. <laughs> okay, a little introduction for those of you guys who don't know me and probably are watching this video for the very first time. It's me, my name is uh, Nikita P. Kutti and that's Wowari Lucky for you guys. Well, so let's get started because our topic for today is Dark Circle. So apparently I've seen so many DMs and everybody has been asking to do something about Dark Circles. But you know what? There are like 2,000 creams in the market who will tell you that they will help you get rid of the dark circles. Well, do you think that's true? Well, I believe nothing works until and unless you get into the root cause of your dark circles. Like you really need to know, you know, what is causing your dark circles. Let us divide the dark circles into three types. Okay, so then it will become easier for me to tell you which one is that one you have and for you to really know what is the type of dark circles that you are facing your troubles with. So the first type of dark circles that we're gonna talk about is the blue dark circles. Usually we are bologe are blue dark circles. Oh. See, so if you're fair skin, like really, really fair skin, probably you will be able to see the blue dark circles, which is not really light blue in color, which is very dark blue in the color. Uh, if you're like medium skin tone, like that of the Indian skin tone, you'll not be able to see it. But the blue dark circles are actually caused when you do everything you're not supposed to do. Like if you don't sleep on time, if you have any allergic problems, um, you're smoking, all of these things are actually going to cause you blue dark circles, even stress for that matter, sleeping late, lack of sleep, everything causes blue dark circles. So most of the people who are doing all of these things by now know that they have blue dark circles, which won't be looking like blue blue because you're not fair skin, but they exist. Also, I'm sure most of you guys know that the, the skin under our eye is like really thin. And sometimes uh, there is something known as slow microcirculation at your eye area. So the blood becomes less oxygenated. And that's also one of the reasons that you might get this kind of blue uh, dark surface. So, enough of problems. Now let's see if we have a solution for this one. Solution number one is that you sleep properly. Solution number two is that you can meditate. Solution number three is a home remedy that you can probably do. I will show you how now. I need coffee, Johnson baby cream, almond oil. So just take a scoop of coffee, put it in a small bowl and add a few drops of almond oil to it. Make sure that you whisk it really well. So you're just supposed to whisk, whisk, whisk because we don't want uh, the granules to, you know, granules and it needs to be really thin like water now i'm going to put it in the microwave oven uske andar maine dal diya hai ab usko main timer laga ke rakh dungi for a good 1 minute itne mein jo coffee hai uska kya hoga ye to aap jante hi hain coffee jo hai wo pighal jayegi ek bar halki si coffee pighal gayi Get it out of the microwave oven. Now you mix it in the Johnson baby cream. Okay, you mix it and you have to keep whisking it out. Now, after this, you have to use So, you have to use the ring finger. Because this ring finger is the pressure of the So, we'll use that ring finger. Apply it properly around your eyes. Slowly. Coffee is actually going to help you out with stress. It will help you out with the darkness. So it will, you know, and you will even have almond oil in this, the baby cream, everything put together will give you exactly what you need. That is the soothing effect. Now, massage it out really well onto your eyes. Now, what you have to do is just go to sleep. Once you wake up in the morning, make sure you wipe it out or just wash it off with warm water. Just give a little pat onto your eyes, do a little nice massage, everything that's gonna probably help you out with these kind of dark circles. Trust me, I think you guys have it and y'all don't even know about it. Well, the second type of dark circle is what I have, you have, and I think everyone and most of us have is brown or pigmented dark circles. The dark pigmentish brown uh, dark circles which most of us have and this is very prone to the indian skin tone and this happens due to either sun damage or hyperpigmentation hyperpigmentation i'm sure you know that your this part of the area is obviously um 
releasing more melanin than otherwise. Well, there are so many creams in the market, right? Yeah, so basically most of the creams in the market that you see usually are trying to uh, help you get rid of these type of dark circles which are caused due to sun damage or hyperpigmentation most of the times and it's got nothing to do with the blue dark circles for that matter. What you can probably do at home is make your own cream. Like now you know that it is hyperpigmentation and you know it's due to sun damage so for sun damage control you have sunscreen lagana hai. obviously hyperpigmentation is when it's obviously generating a lot of melanin so what you need to do is figure out what you can do with the white cream. I'm going to show you how I made this cream for myself. Um, this is a cream that I made. You can apply it in the night. Now, this is what I'm going to start using for now because I have a little bit of uh, dark circles which are coming my way. If you want, you can use it. Don't tell me things later on, okay? So, let me show you how I make my dark circle cream. Lumivoid cream because it's good for hyperpigmentation. Then we need Fair and Lovely, which is whitening, and Adorn. Uh, basically, I'm using the Adorn cream because it's really good for soothing. So mix all the three creams. I've just taken a chutki of each one of them, just mixed it all together, like really nice, and applied it under my eye and above my eye. And now I'm just gonna give it a light a massage, and that's it. So ring finger again and just do this and good to go just do that guys and go to sleep and yes all these things are gonna take time but yeah sooner or later i think should be good to go in a good seven days we should be better with our dark circles Dark circle type 3 is actually shadow dark circle so basically uh this is like an illusion and it is not real dark circles usually what happens is because we apply a lot of kajal so wo kajal jo yaha ka hai pura spread ho jata hai that is one of the reasons you will see that people have those baggy things and everything so that is one uh, type of a dark circles which we call shadow because they are not really existing in real second uh, thing in this happens is that there are certain individuals who have their eyes pop inside okay they have a kind of a hollow structure so ye jo hai iska shadow yahan pe girta hai aur us wajah se you can see a kind of a formation in dark which they mistake it to be a dark circle but it is not a dark circle it's just a shadow so for those kind of people the only solution that i have here is Go and see a good eye doctor. Probably they'll pump in some kind of things inside uh, your area so that this becomes a little bit puffed and your eyes can just pop a little out. There is no solution for you guys. I'm really, really sorry. But that's more genetics and that's how your facial structure is. Please don't feel bad. But I just wish there was something that could be done for you guys. But if you are this shadow type of a dark circle dye people uh, or a person who probably has the hollow effect here happening because of the shadow. Also, if you feel that you have that area really pigmented, you can do the same solution that we have for step two. That is off the people with hyperpigmentation and dark, uh, dark circles. Okay, last thing but not the least, I don't usually say this uh, in a lot of my videos but I'm saying it this time. If you like this video, please don't forget to like it. Don't forget to share because when you share it, I mean it might help somebody who's troubling dark circles and they don't even know which one they're suffering from. So do share it. Do let me know if there's any other information that you have in the comment section below and also if you want me to make a video on something else after this. Till then, bye. <laughs>